Hey y'all, welcome back. Just a short-ish, just a shortish video today. Um, I get to play with some of my um, science and engineering tools. A little while back, I did a video on this blow dryer here. I wanted to play with an anemometer to see how fast, how much air this blow dryer actually blows. I wanted to test the temperature, that those sort of things. And I had promised to do that with other blow dryers too. And honestly, that video didn't get a lot of views. I thought it was fun to know that stuff. So if you want to see the tests with this Chi Nano and see how much air it moves and how hot it gets, I'll put the link right up here. Actually, I'll put it over here. But I had always promised to use my trusty twin turbo, which I've been using for years, and test that. Because when I bought this at the time, it was supposed to move more air than any other dryer on the market. I just never got around to actually testing this one because my anemometer broke. So I got a new one, but this one uh, seems to be calibrated a little bit differently and I'm not getting the same reading. The twin turbo in just trying it out real quick seems to be pushing far less air than this one, uh, which made me kind of suspicious. It could, I, it could just be that this one is not as good as it's supposed to be. I figured I would retest this one for a little bit of calibration and so I can get like sort of a frame of reference. And let's see how much air, how fast the air moving from this is. So 124.7 degrees Fahrenheit, I'll put it up in, in Celsius too, and 19.7 miles per hour. These are definitely, the temperature is probably pretty similar to what I did in the first video, but the airspeed, I remember it being in like the 20s. I'll have to look up that number and I'll put it right here. So that gives me some context to compare this one now. I'm really curious about the temperature and the airspeed, of course. So let's check it out. Right, 25.3 miles an hour, which I think is significantly faster than the Chi. But the real shocker here, I got a, a max reading, leaving for maybe for some margin of error, but a max reading of 193 degrees Fahrenheit. That is really, that's really, that's almost hot enough to boil water. That's kind of shocking how hot this gets. I had no idea. I actually, looks like I maybe melted my anemometer a little bit. I gotta be careful with that. I think I broke it. Oh my gosh. I, <laughs> dang it. I... <laughs> well, it looks like I'm gonna need another anemometer. I actually melted the plastic on this one. Uh, now it's not working. Maybe you're not a true YouTuber until you've broken all of your equipment. I don't know. That one's done for. Well, I guess that's the end of that video. Is the Twin Turbo 3200 hotter than the Chi? Yes. Hot enough to melt my equipment. Uh, does it blow more air than the Chi? Yes. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Oh my gosh. Thanks for watching this video. If you like what you saw and you want to see some more, go ahead and check out some of my other videos. Feel free to share with any of your nerdy friends. Click the subscribe button. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below. Let me know what else you want to hear about. Thank you so much for stopping by and I'll see you next time.